hello and welcome back to my channel i know i'm looking a little bit crazy right now but i promise you i'm going to fix my hair i wanted to show you how i do my hair when i add extensions on and when i curl it most of the times i always have my hair up in a like low bun and that's because i have to choose one or the other sometimes either i do my makeup no hair or i do my hair and no makeup so i just rather do my makeup and just sleek my hair back anyways is like it's just better to keep the hair out of the face sometimes it's been a while i don't wear it down and curly my hair has grown from how it was it was pretty short but i have like a box of toys right here so i may have to like keep pausing because he's going to want my attention throughout probably this whole video but let's see if i can make it through this whole video without like having to stop so um yeah my hair this is the length that my hair is currently at right now for extensions um i have always used the bellamy extensions i used to use the lily galici ones and then i tried the um, bugatti and that is the set that i'm going to be using today the bugatti extensions are a lot of hair with the bugatti extensions you get a weft that is like this big it has like two rows and this itself is a lot of hair so besides this one you do get additional wefts when my hair was shorter i would use all of them just because i would have a lot of volume up here but nothing down here but now that my hair is pretty long it's very easy to just clip this section on and i can do my hair also a lot faster and then i always use the bellamy detangling brush as for my hair texture i have natural curly hair but right now it's not too curly i do a very tight bun so i kind of feel like that helps me kind of like sleek it out a little bit i haven't strained it i haven't done anything to it i love to use this brush to detangle it i just gave him his bottle so i probably have like i don't know five minutes to kind of keep going without having to stop so for heat protectant i use a tresemme keratin smooth um heat protectant spray i just spray it mainly in the ends of my hair and i feel like it kind of feels thicker and healthier especially because i haven't really been doing anything to my hair it feels really soft once i brush my hair out now i'm going to add the extension in usually i like to start pretty low but since this one is heavy and it's like a bigger section i'm gonna do it maybe like two inches i want to say above my ear and then we will start curling i've been using bellamy extensions for such a long time i remember oh it was like maybe when my daughter was like a baby i i want to say it's also really long i forgot how many inches the bugatti um extensions are i think they're 20 i don't really remember but so what i do is i know a lot of people tease their hair and it probably does help and then you add hairspray but honestly i don't i just i don't know i don't like to do that because when i have done that my hair has gotten so tangled and it's just like a mess so i just rather put them in and they do last i mean on me they do last all day with this bigger section i always start with the bottom clips the middle ones and then I'm actually also used to putting on like my extensions without having to look in a mirror or anything. This is what they look like on. So now I have a little bit more volume and a little bit more length as well. But if I was to like put on all of the webs that come with the Bugatti set, it would be like a crazy amount of hair. It looks really pretty, but I'm just wanting something a little bit more simple today. I just wanted a little bit of length. So now once I do that, I just part my hair in the middle. I should have brought my comb, but I'm just really trying to get through doing my hair before, before this happens.
The curler that I'm going to be using is this one by Hot Tools. I found it at Marshalls and I typically go for like wands, but I figured I could just wrap my hair around this one. This one has the on and off button right here. I already turned it on and it goes up to 450 yeah. degrees and that is what I have it at. I like a thicker barrel because you kind of finish faster and it just takes less time. So I just start with the top always. And then I just wrap it around for a few seconds. Typically, I like to do it for maybe about 20 seconds. But today, I just want like loose waves and to just kind of calm my hair down because it's very like all over the place. And I'm really liking that curl. I'm not going to spray hairspray just yet until the end. Just so the curl can kind of fall a little bit. And then at the end, that's when I'll add hairspray. Usually I add hairspray to each curl whenever I'm going to like a party and I do my hair with a tighter curl, but right now I'm just going to go all over my head and take sections. I never really like to section off my hair whenever I have the extensions on. What I do is I just like take pieces of hair starting from the top and then I'll work my way down it's just i don't know it's just faster for me but yeah i'm just gonna repeat this all over on this side this is why i never really get to do my hair because if i had him down here with me he would probably be wanting to touch everything and it would just it just wouldn't be pretty so if you're a mom of a baby or toddler then you probably know how it is when they're like crawling and walking everywhere, they want to touch everything, especially where you're at. They want to see what you're doing. So it's kind of like a little bit hard. So as you can see, my hair is also looking very shiny. I'm loving this hair tool. And then I'm just going to grab sections from the bag. It sounds like he wants to talk to. this side is done and now moving on to this one i mean it kind of looks similar but it just needs to be a little bit more smooth and when my hair whenever i air dry it and i don't like put it up in a bun or anything and it just gets curly and frizzy what i have to always do is i have to like strain it and then i have to go back in and curl it so it's like double the work but i mean i still love my curly hair even though i hardly wear it like that i mean it doesn't make any sense like i have curly hair but yet here i am curling my hair with a hot tool whenever i want really loose waves i just do the curls all the same way so like facing outwards but whenever i want kind of like more voluminous curls then i do like I alternate one piece I'll do in one piece I'll do outwards but today just something very like casual junior I put like a lot of little toys in there so he's entertained i was in the mood to curl my hair but honestly i i don't even remember when was the last time i wore it down like i think sometimes i wear it down for pictures but then like right as soon as i'm done taking the pictures i put it back up i don't know what it is about me and like putting my hair up now I think you can kind of tell in almost every video or my Instagram pictures, I'm wearing my hair up. 
Junior. Hey. I gave him a little gum container. It doesn't have any gum inside. He loves to play with those. So whenever I have a gum container that's already empty, I like to give it to him. So now that I kind of finished overall curling my hair, I'm just going to go in and look for pieces that kind of need a little touch up. Now I have a long and bouncy curls. I always struggle with this one little hair. I have crazy baby hairs. I'm just gonna carefully kind of bring it in like that and just kind of tuck it underneath. For hairspray, I'm going to be taking my BioSilk Silk Therapy finishing spray and this one has been a really long time that i don't use i found it at marshall's and before i bought this one i was using the big sexy hair hairspray you know the red can with the black top i was looking for that one at marshall's because i was there and i remembered i ran out of hairspray but then i came across this one and i remembered how much i used to love bio silk products so i got this one and i love the smell of it the smell of bio silk is just very nice so what i do now is i just lightly add some here is what my hair looks like with the extensions on and after curling it i just went through it very quickly it's a very fast and easy hairstyle perfect for like every day you can just add maybe some hair pins on the side i love the look of the long hair the long waves this is just like my favorite hairstyle i just i really don't have time for this every single day though i wish i did but I don't so that's why I always do like the low bun. I don't even know if this was really like a tutorial because it was just very easy and simple but I just really wanted to show you how I do my hair when I do do my hair. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you didn't mind my little man right here in the back. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.